Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Aries. This is for Aries Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the month of December. This could resonate at any time in December, so keep that in mind. And again, this reading may or may not be for you. We get a lot of people that try to make readings fit. If it's not for you, it's not for you. Take what resonates and leave the rest. What do we have for Aries in December? A message for Aries at any time in December. Ooh, I knew it. I had seen the nine of pen the Knight of Pentacles. I saw it, but it was upright. But here it is reversed. So the Knight of Pentacles is a test. You're gonna be tested. Oh, you may be tested by the Empress. You may be tested by the Empress. Or you, if you are the feminine, this is you. If you are the masculine, this isn't you. Okay, this is a female. It's a feminine. Um, this is somebody that is beautiful. This is a beautiful soul. Tender, loving care. This person has a lot of life experience. Beautiful. Glowing. Okay, everybody loves this person. It looks as to me as though it's harvest time as well. This is the goddess of love. There's an outpouring of love. There's an outpouring of emotion. So this is all about love. So this is this is the first card, the Empress. So if you are the feminine, you are the feminine watching this, whether you are the cross watcher or the the feminine watching this is absolutely glowing. The pick. This is the pick. This could be the mother. This 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 could this is the mother. This is the mother. But this this Knight of Pentacles reverse, this is this is being tested. This is a quiet test. A practical test. But this is not being practical. And this is something stalling or not moving forward. No movement. No movement at all. This person, maybe she's focused on being a mother. It's all about uh, love and care and being gentle and unconditional love. And so things aren't moving. Things aren't moving. This person is very confident, knows her value, knows her worth, is not easy. This person is not your side chick. This person is very valuable and they know it. So we have a very valuable individual individual here who is beautiful. This is beauty and love and abundance. It has it all. And this person just waits, is in no hurry. Definitely in no hurry. So there's somebody here that is in no hurry to uh, do anything by the looks of things. In no hurry at all. Very comfortable with where they are at. A lot of life experience right there in that Empress card. Definitely in no hurry. Two more. Wow. Knight of Swords and the Seven of Pentacles. Definitely in no hurry. That's the meaning of this card reverse. It's funny I said it with this one. There's no rush. No rush at all. Patience, time, nurturing, you know, that's where it's at. It takes time for things to grow. And whoever whoever this person is, is in absolutely no hurry uh, to do anything. Seriously, in no hurry. So that's, I'm sorry for repeating myself, but obviously somebody needs to hear that. This is a card of perseverance. Somebody's probably thinking, is it worth it? Should I keep investing here? This, you know, what should I invest in? Somebody is thinking about relocating. They may be relocating. Somebody could be dealing with an untrustworthy individual who um, maybe they've stolen from them. You know, this is, there, there could be a thief here. Somebody doesn't care who they hurt. You could be dealing with a thief, a liar, somebody that is an energy thief as well. So there, there's somebody here that is probably thinking about escaping or thinking about going someplace away from this person. You know, 
this up here, this person is so abundant. It's like if if they decide to go anywhere, people are going to flock to them to help them. This person gets help because of their energy, because of their nature. It's just in their nature to help others. So, you know, what you put out there is what you bring back. Because this person is unconditional love, that's the energy that this person pulls back to them. So this person, it has it all because of who they are so anyway if this is you Aries don't be worried if you're worried that you're not going to receive any help if you are the Aries female watching this the female that is watching this this is you receiving a blessing for the hard work for the pain for the endurance okay if you are the masculine watching this you may have this beauty around you but this beauty is in no hurry okay she's in no hurry absolutely um, and somebody is thinking, is it worth it? Is it worth it? Should I go someplace else? Somebody has also been dealing with a person that uh, isn't a very good energy, a very dark energy. But it's like I see a situation clearly now. It's coming out of confusion. Coming out of illusion. Okay. Okay. becoming clear somebody has a clear it's like they see they see that whoever they've been dealing with is untrustworthy and a liar and a thief and full of shit it's like they see clearly and it's time to go someplace else and this is harvest time as well it's like a season is over so i do believe that there is a season that is over a season within your life there's a better opportunity here Wow, 777, seven, seven. 7 is a number from heaven, okay, so it's a card of faith, you need to have faith, you're definitely dealing with a thief, like I said, you it's like you've been robbed, somebody has been robbed, or they could be robbed this month, just be careful, you could be dealing with a real thief, I mean, somebody could be sneaking in and stealing something from you. So be careful. Somebody is definitely very sneaky and shady and they think that they're going to get away with it. So be really, really, really careful. We have a liar here. Could be dealing with a cheater. Somebody that is so sly and sneaky. I mean, very sly. Maybe there's a higher power here because like I said, number seven is a number from heaven. Maybe there's, there's some sort of uh, higher power that is going to make things abundantly clear for you so be prepared be pay attention to the signs at this time because i feel like there is like a outside force that is going to show you uh who is lying to you who is whatever and it's be and and it is and it and if you are the feminine watching this i feel like you're going to be shown this because of who you are on the inside we definitely have a have a liar here seriously um and the situation is going to be made clear. Somebody is going to see. It's like if you were confused or you weren't seeing it or you didn't know if this was real, if you didn't know that what you were thinking was real or if you didn't, you know, you were to, you were sh unsure, y your clarity is going to come. Okay? Whew. There's definitely an imbalance here. Seriously, you could be dealing with somebody has, who has addictions. Um... It's like somebody that you are not seeing eye to eye with. It's somebody that you don't mingle well with. There is definitely a feeling of angst and frustration. Somebody may be upset with you because of you. They may be jealous of you. If you especially if you're the feminine or they could be jealous of this person. There is jealousy here. So there is definitely some jealousy. There's upheaval. There's imbalance. There's extremes, extremes, high, extreme highs and lows. You could be dealing with somebody that is bipolar. Somebody needs to take action. The nine of nine of pentacles reversed. There's insecurity here. 
It's like you, you really need to listen to what your gut is telling you. I think that your gut is telling you that you're dealing with a liar and a thief and you've been trying to discount it. You've been trying to go with the benefit of the doubt. But I'm here to tell you that you're you're probably, in, you know, you need to realize that whoever this person is, is not stable. They're not secure. They're, they probably don't have enough to survive. And they're using, it's like somebody's being used here. I'm sorry. Or stolen from. There's a loss of abundance here. Something is, somebody, there's uh, another seven, by the way. So we got four sevens. There's a lack of faith. Faith in yourself, I believe. A lack of believing in oneself. Now, things that somebody's like going backwards, they're stuck in a place of fear. And it's like you need to take back control of this situation, but you're going to have to take the lead. So it feels like we have somebody here that is refusing to see, but you're going to see. Something is going to be revealed. Some sort of sneaky behavior is going to be revealed that is going to be, it's going to be abundantly clear that you're dealing with a snake. And I think something is going to come to a complete stop, a complete halt with this chariot reverse. Reversed. Somebody has definitely not been headed in the right direction. And it's like their finances or their money is going downhill. You know, karma works in mysterious ways. When you make the wrong choices, they will they will hit you in the pocketbook. They will hit you in the wallet. So somebody may be experiencing some financial losses because they invested in something that was not practical. But this is the birth of a new life. So somebody may be giving birth or starting over. So that's the very first card. This, both of these cards are something coming to a stop. No more movement. No more moving forward. Seeing a situation. Clearly this isn't stable. It's not secure. It's a loss. There's been some lies. There's been maliciousness. Somebody has acted maliciously. And it's like seeing it. Seeing that you're dealing with a very malicious person. So I think that this month you it is going to be revealed to you. The truth about the snake. Whatever snake this is that you're dealing with. You are definitely dealing with a snake that does not care who they hurt. They, they, they speak without thinking. They may be a gossip. They like to cause problems. There's going to be a conflict of some sort. And there's, going to, there's anger. There's definitely some anger here. Somebody's going to get really frustrated by the reveal And they're probably going to decide not to work together with this person anymore. There's no teamwork. There's no collaboration. There's no more compromise. There's a lack of respect. Could have something to do with a Taurus or a Libra. We have Sagittarius here. But I feel as though there's some sort of mother involved. Mother of the children or something like that. Because this is the mother This is this could also be somebody sneaking away from an an uh, impractical situation, escaping seriously, just getting out. Somebody could be getting out, getting away from something that isn't stable. That's been a lie. That's been really, it's been like um, very troublesome. Okay, with that Knight of Swords reverse, it's been very uh, turbulent. Okay, the Knight of Swords reverse. There's been a lot of turbulence here, but this is getting away, getting out. Somebody could be getting out. Deciding, I'm not going to do this anymore. I'm not even going to communicate with you. I'm done. I'm done. And it is like something is coming to a complete halt. It's like, I'm done. Because somebody sees the situation absolutely clearly. They've been stomped on. They've been lied to. And heaven is involved here or a higher power with all these sevens. All is not as it seems. There is definitely some deception here. You could be dealing with the Pisces or cancer. But something is coming to a complete halt and that is the truth. I think that this deception is about to be revealed and somebody's life is going to be turned upside down. 
There's something below the surface that you have not been able to see or maybe you just didn't want to see it. This is an illusion. That's the meaning. Illusion. But this is coming out of illusion. So I think whatever has been hidden is about to be revealed this month. And somebody's going to be very upset and they're going to be frustrated. And it's going to, it's like things are definitely going to be turned upside down, upside down, upside down, upside down, upside down, upside down. Yeah, things are going to be turned upside down if they haven't been already. So get prepared for something that has been below the surface to be shown to come out. Somebody may have been working, you know, together to bring another person down, to cause another person upset, you know, working as a team. These people were working in a team as a team in a malicious way. They were being malicious to bring another person down, but this person is protected. Okay. This person is protected by the universe. So I think that there's a, some sort of financial loss that is being experienced because of somebody's poor choices. It's the card of consequences, the seven of cups. Somebody made some poor choices. Now they're experiencing financial woes because uh, they invested in something that was probably a dead end or something like that. Or they just, you know, didn't care who they hurt. And karma works in mysterious ways. We got three more cards here. King of Wands, that's you taking action. So somebody's going to be taking action. Doing doing the noble thing. It's like, I got to do what's right. This is a protector. It's like they get this vision that there's been an injustice. And there is definitely some karma here with this justice card reversed. Somebody is going to be stopped in their track by tracks by universal law we have justice reversed karma so yeah we got some karma here it's unfair there's been some unfair treatment there's been somebody who didn't want to be held accountable they want to be held accountable for any of their actions didn't care, did not act with integrity, lied like a rug. Liar, liar, pants on fire. This liar is going to receive some karma and it's going to affect their wallet. Whoever hasn't been telling the truth is going to, is going to experience um, a, financial, a financial setback. That's what I see. But this is going to open up a new doorway. It's going to be starting over because that's what this is. It's like starting, you're starting from the bottom. Somebody's going to be starting from the bottom. And they're going to need to focus and they're going to need to go down a new path that they have never been down before. So somebody's going to be going down a path they have never been down before. Are you ready for the last card? The Queen of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So, we have somebody that has the golden opportunity in their hand. They're going to be receiving the gift of the golden opportunity. This person is stable. This person is solid. This person is devoted. This person is a hard worker. This person is solid, very generous, and capable. So, this person is receiving an opportunity, and this person is very valuable. This person knows their value in is going to be holding on to something, is going to get the reward. So it feels like somebody is getting a reward here, but somebody else is getting karma, and it's not bad karma. So I feel like we have somebody here that is seeing an injustice for what it is. They are, they're seeing it clearly. And it's like they're giving, they're giving the opportunity 
to this other person. Somebody could be receiving money or a bonus or an increase or something like that. This person is very grounded. She's a natural. She's a natural mother. Or a natural caregiver. So Aries, I feel like if you have, for some of you, you're going to be receiving a blessing. For some of you have been cheated. Some of you maybe may find out that you've been cheated on. Okay, just saying. I mean, I got to be honest with you. Some of you may may hear the news and it's not good news. A new message you don't want to hear. Somebody has been lied to, somebody has been cheated, somebody has been robbed or whatever it is. Somebody was dealing with a snake and they're going to receive a message or clarity or something about this deception, okay? There's been some lies, there's been some deception and that's going to be revealed. It does have to do with this person right here. This is a Taurus or a Libra. Could be you as well if you were the feminine. It's over. It's harvest time. It's time to pack up and go someplace else for some of you. Something is going, it's like a, this is a dead end. It's over. It's, it's really time to go off someplace else. Something is coming to an end. Somebody's going to be hit in their bank account for their poor decisions by karma. They could lose their job, their home, or not get the payout that they thought they were going to get. There could be a shift. There could be a change. A change that you didn't see coming. And you may think that it is really, 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 really unfair. But karma has a way of affecting people in ways that they never imagined. There is a new doorway opening that perhaps you didn't see, okay? There's a reason for this. It is time to start over. It's starting over, seriously. There's a new opportunity that you can grow and grow, you know, grow again. Start over. It's starting over. So I believe that this is a month of, of somebody receiving perhaps the opportunity that they can bank on it's like this is a this is something that that you can uh put in the bank or save or hold on to this person is so stable and and generous it's like this person is holding on and waiting it's this could be a taurus i'm not sure if it is a taurus but it could be but it could be a, a taurus virgo cap it could be anybody but this person is holding on, holding on to their value, holding on to their secure, security, very secure, green is color money in nature and whatever we could go on. But anyway, so anyway, we got somebody here that is very solid, stable and secure. And it's like they are getting a gift. So somebody is getting a gift and you probably didn't even see it. So Aries, I feel as though you may be, if you are waiting for this person, you know, whoever, if you are the Aries male and you got this feminine that you want and, and she's not giving you the attention that you want, maybe you got to be patient. Maybe she's a mother. Maybe she has to focus on her motherhood, whatever the case is. If you are the Aries male, I feel like you are going to see that whoever you were dealing with in the past was a liar and a thief. And you probably see that you have a bigger, better opportunity. And you may have to be patient. And this is lack of patience. Be patient. The reason it didn't work out with the other one is because... Well, I don't see any love in these cards. They may have been, just been invested for the money portion of it. And when you jump... And when you leap and when you move too fast, you don't, you don't realize those kinds of things. This person definitely knows their value. And anybody that moves fast is not in their league. Anyway, good luck. That's what I got. So for December, I feel as though there's, there's going to be a message that is delivered about whoever you've been dealing with. Uh, that has been lying and cheating or they cheated or whatever. And I feel like you're going to receive the clarity that gives you the truth and helps you to move on from this person or to choose another option. 
Okay, you're going to receive the clarity. There's going to be something that is said that just like wakes you up. And pushes you in another direction. So I do see you going in another direction. But I don't see if you, if you are the male and you got this beautiful person up here that you are in a hurry to snap up. I suggest you uh, sit back and be practical because this person is in no hurry. Good luck.